In the United States, household electricity is an alternating current that is a sinusoid. If the max voltage is 156 volts and the frequency is 60 hertz, write a function to represent the situation. Assume an initial voltage of zero. Now, if we're assuming an initial voltage of zero, that's going to be a sine function. So here's what our function is going to look like. Voltage as a function of time is going to equal to A sine of Bx. So voltage as a function of time equals A, which is the amplitude. Now, if the max voltage is 156 volts, let me sketch a little graph here. We're going to start at zero and then go up to 156, back down to zero, down to a negative 156, like this. So right here is going to be 156 volts, and right here is going to be 156 volts. Okay, that's what alternating current is like. So our volts is a function of time, the amplitude is 156. And now we need to determine the B value, which is based on the period. Now the frequency is given as 60 hertz. And that's 1 over the period. And we said before the period is 2 pi divided by b. So the frequency is b divided by 2 pi. So 60 is b divided by 2 pi. And we can cross multiply here and solve 120 pi equals b. Okay, so that's what we're going to put for our b value. Okay, and that's it. There are no translations, no reflections. So this is our function for that alternating current. Voltage is a function of time. V of t is 156 sine of 120 pi times t.